Hi there. Good afternoon. Hi there. How many volunteers have you got supporting people in the queues? Um, today we've got about 150 volunteers out actually on the queue at any one time. Uh, we'll be providing medical support with our colleagues in London Ambulance Service throughout 24-7 so that we can actually um, provide support and allow people to remain in the queue so they can make their way um, to the front and to the Palace of Westminster. Thankfully, it's not raining at the moment, but the temperature has dropped a little bit. Um, what sort of problems are you having to deal with, Mike? Because I gather even one of the guards inside Westminster Hall keeled over overnight, fainted. I mean, uh, you know, this is not literally for the faint-hearted. It, it's not. And I think um, as difficult as it is to say this, um, people that want to go in queue really need to think about can they walk four hours, oh, four miles, um, the last information I had was it takes about nine hours um, to move along. Um, and we are seeing people um, who are struggling because of existing medical conditions. So as I say, as difficult as it is, um, just think about what, what's required. And if you are going to come up, uh, we're seeing the temperatures drop a lot overnight. And last night we deployed additional resources and additional blankets to, to cope with that. Um, and we're, we're doing the same tonight, but um, it's, a long, it's a long journey.